Hey guys, how's it going? It's Hyde here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Foundry. And in the last episode, we set up our crushers here to start turning the ore into crushed ore. And we did the same thing over there at our other factory. We also went ahead and started setting up some steel production, which is okie dokie. We're getting that moving and grooving. So we got some steel. We got all sorts of ingots. After the last episode, I did go ahead and finish upgrading our furnaces here so we should be able to keep up with a full belt at all times now the only problem is i don't know if this belt here is actually going to be full all the time with the number of miners that we have but i think it's going to be close oh yeah oh yeah 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 these guys are definitely able to keep up we even have a little bit extra to spare okay so that's awesome so we got ourselves a full yellow belt here of well, metal plates coming out, and I have it coming out on two belts right now. Probably could have done it on one, but the merger that I have right now is a tier one, and it's no good for this. So we've got it on two. I'm sending this belt down there to get turned into science, and this belt is getting used up and turned into all sorts of crafting things. After the last episode, I did go ahead and set up this container here for foundations. So if we ever need more foundations, we are ready to go. Oh my god, I can't wait to expand. Oh, okay. So what do we want to work on next? I guess we could start looking at some mm, new research. Should I just do this? I should just maybe do this. Let's just get this out of the way, right? Let me as well. Get some extra inventory size. This is looking just absolutely fabulous. Oh my god, I love this. Okay, um, next thing we want to work on is, 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 I should probably just get rid of some of this ore in my inventory. Hmm, hang on. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this or not, but I would love to be able to just stick this right in here. Pop it up. Oh, perfect exactly what i wanted okay so what i want to work on next i think is some high voltage power maybe oh my god look at this factory i'm so happy with this okay um so high voltage power did i unlock it yet i don't even know if i did i don't even know if i did let's take another look here at our research High voltage energy grid. Okay, we haven't actually done that yet, but we are going to need pipes. So maybe we get started on those. And we also are probably going to need pipe intakes. And I don't know what this thing is. Hopefully we don't need a lot of those because it takes biomass and I don't want to do that right now. So we're going to need pipes and then we're going to have to mix the pipes with machinery parts to get that. And this takes two steel beams. Okie dokie. Let's see here. How do I want to do this? We got steel over there. Ah, oh, man, I need more. I need more miners going this way. Right? Like, this is just not enough. We're only getting 80. 88 per minute. Do I want more? I feel like I want more, but I don't know. How are these guys getting down to the mine? Oh, they're just going under there. I wonder if it would make it faster if I was to get rid of a tile in here for them. Does that help you guys? Does that make it a little bit quicker? Huh? I don't know if that's actually going to help or not, but whatever. It's fine. Let's go down here. And what I would like to do is start turning this steel into something. And maybe while I'm at it, I could get just a small little spot here making us, um, making us, yeah, I'm going to split this off, making us crushed resources. So if I do something like that, we can crush it, we can smelt it, and then we can turn it into mechanical components because we're going to need some of those. So I think this is not the worst idea I've ever had. I've had some pretty bad ideas before, but this is not one of them, I don't think. I think this is a pretty good one. So we're going to come. We are going to get rid of this. 
And then what I would like to do... I don't know if this is actually the right side for this or not. It's probably not the best, but eh, whatever. It is what it is. So we're going to come through here. We're going to go into a crusher. And do I have a crusher? I should have one. I need to make some more of these. So we'll go into a crusher. Where do I want to do this? I don't know. Good question. Um... Let's just do it here. I think that's good. We'll just do it here. And I guess I didn't need this belt. So that is going to crush us that. And then we're going to just insert this directly in to a smelter. Oh, that's no good. I don't have room. Let's let's cancel this part. I'm going to go with the other side. Whoa, whoa, what am I deleting here? Okay, I think we're going to go up this side. So we're going to put the smelter over here. Okay, and we're going to need that and this. We can set that to output. We can do that. Um why is this not output come on output there we go so that is going to start putting that into here that's going to start making us plates and then the plates we are going to just turn straight in to mechanical components and this thing is not in the right spot at all we need a couple tiles in between there something like something like this okay then we'll put that in we'll put this out and bingo let's set this to be mechanical components or machinery parts same thing all right and then what am i trying to make over here i'm trying to make pipes so we're gonna need some more assemblers i don't know where i want to do this maybe i'll do it over here I don't think I want to just take the steel and turn it all into pipes. So maybe I'll do something over here. And... Oh, I need more foundations. One second. You know what I was just thinking? If I have this all the way over here already, I could just connect it in there. And if I have extras, I could just have them get dumped in. Because why not? You know what I'm saying? I think that's a great idea. So let's do this. I'm going to need a up belt. And then if for some reason stuff manages to get all the way over here, then I guess we don't really care if it goes and gets turned into steel as well, do we? I don't think so. Oh, we do care. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. Oh, what have I done? I've made a mistake. I don't think that regular, uh, the crushed ore, I don't think it's going to go into our steel factory. I guess we can find out in a second. It's definitely going to plug this thing up. Yeah, see, those are not going to go in there. Okay. Good, good. I don't know what's going to happen once it gets over here. Did any of it come over here? Yeah, it's going to plug everything up. Okay, well, there goes that idea. It was worth a shot. Okay, I think that about does it. Dang it! I, I thought it was going to be a great idea, but it's not. So if we're going to do something cheesy like that, then what I am going to have to do is take that belt that's coming through the crushers take that one and wrap it around over here and that's a lot less convenient so i don't know if i'm gonna do that or not all right guys you sucked me into it you changed my mind whoever commented and told me to do it you uh you changed my mind i'm gonna just do it it was worth it well i actually don't know but anyway whoops so basically the machines over there get first priority, and if for some reason stuff manages to get by, then it is going to send it down this way to get turned into steel. It's not the worst. 
you know, it's not bad. It's the best we can do for now. So that's all fine and well. Do I have enough crafters to actually get this to work? I kind of do. You might need to go get some more. But for now, we'll leave it. Let's get some steel. We're going to start making pipes. And I don't know where I want to do this. I guess I'll just feed the items in the back. I probably am not going to need this many pipes. Let's not. Let's just not. Why, am it, why would I ever need that many pipes? Okay, we will set this to be pipes. Now I gotta get steel in there, which is not a problem. We have the technology here. So I'm just gonna really quickly get that up. Get that down. And... Oh no. I didn't leave room. I never leave room. I always forget that the inserters have to be one square away and it gets me every time. Okay, so we'll do something like this. If for some reason I need more steel, then we will just get more steel. Okay, that is gonna start making us pipes. And then if I just plumb the pipes out and in, this will actually allow me to not work. I need this here. I was about to say this will allow me to plumb the extra pipes out into something else if I decide I need to do that. So that's not a bad idea. And then where is this thing? Mm -hmm -hmm. We'll put this guy right here. And where do I want to put it actually here? Let's we'll put it here. Ooh, that's fine. You are going to make me intake pipes. I don't know what that actually does. All right, and then we just got to get these guys out of here and into there, which is not a problem whatsoever. What if I take one of these long ones? Uh, I don't even need a long one. We'll just do this. Okay, just like so okay so that is going to start making us the thingamabobbers the uh, i don't know what the heck these are for pipe intake i guess that is probably the part that i put in the water or whatever and i'm gonna need a bunch of these likely so we're gonna take those let's see we can start to unlock some high voltage power. We also probably want tanks allows to store liquids and gases. Let's do this first. Oh yeah, we've already done that. Okay, we already done that. Power lines, power poles, transformer, boiler, water. Okay, okay, what does this take? Steam. Oh my gosh. Okay, it takes a bunch of pipes, some steel beams, electronic parts. Um, it's gonna be, get a little tricky to make these. Because the steel and pipe component. Oh, these things though. I could just make these automatic right over here. I've already got all of the stuff. Pipe, steel, and machinery parts? That's not even, that's not even a problem. Pipe, steel. Um, pipe. Hmm. I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna have room for all this stuff in here. Uh, we got pipes. We got steel. I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna get those. I guess I could do something really janky. I'm really good at building janky things. If you haven't picked that up already, slope up. Now, the question is, am I going to be able to build on top of here? No. Okay. Hang on. Whoops. Then in that case, what I'm going to do is move this over here like this. Okay. So that should get us working. Slope down and slope down. Oh, I love that. I love that. All right. So we can start making boilers over here. Again, I'm not going to need a lot 
of these, I imagine, but it's going to be nice to have them automated. Just trying to figure out the best way to do this. I might actually run this belt around. There we go. There we go. And then this belt, the steel. Mm, it's not the best. It's not the best. Well, for now, we'll leave it. I might have to do something funky with that yet when I need more of it. But put this here. And we can put these guys on the back. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Put those on there. This guy. Oh, how am I going to do this, actually? I'm going to probably need more steel somewhere else. So we're going to need to do something janky so I can take that steel and go put it somewhere else. This is going to make us boilers eventually. Wait, did I not start the research? I didn't even start the research. That's how smart I am. Okay, so that's going to start making us boilers. And then the other thing that we wanted was steam turbines, pipe machinery parts, steel beams, all I really need to do is get electronic components over here. That is probably a lot of work. So maybe what we'll do is there, I think I can extract out of those storages. So if I just come over here and I just take, if I just take a whole bunch of these, yoink, oh yoink, there we go. Yoinky, and that one's already empty. How about this one? Does this one have some stuff? Where's the stupid terminal? Oh god. It's probably on that side. I can't... No, I can't get it. Well, anyway, I don't need it. We got enough here. I've got a couple storage chests. So if I am able to take out of here, I'll just feed it through like that, I'm thinking. Um, let's put this... Oh boy. Where do I want to put this? Right here? right here let's put that right there it's empty but not for long i can put all these wires in there and then we can put this in there and make sure it's set to extract okay that's not bad we've already got the steel here i'm gonna have to get rid of this rock and make this a little bit bigger. And I'm not going to have room for this. So I'll have to push it back one. Which is maybe fine. Because I can... I probably shouldn't be doing this. Because I'll likely need these somewhere else now that I've done it. But... I can feed those in there like that. And these guys will go in here like that. And in there and in there. Okay, so now I'll be able to make this into the steam. Gotta wait for this to finish. Okay, we can turn this into... What am I trying to make here? Steam boilers or steam... Where's the thing? Science, structures... Wait, do I have to like close this and reopen it? There we go. Steam turbine. Okay, so that is going to start making us turbines. This one is supposed to be making us... The boilers. Oh, absolutely lovely. Okay. And then what are the other things that we need? There was like wire telephone pole thingies. That takes plates and electronic components. We can make that at our main factory. What is this? We can make that at our main factory. Transformer. Okay. Okay. Well, let me just take a few of these to get started. I don't know what the heck it is that I am doing with them. 
but we'll figure it out. I'm gonna need some pipes most likely. So where are my pipes at? Take those. Probably gonna need some of those. We'll take them. How is this all looking here? Do I need more furnaces? I think I do. Oh, it's this bell. There we go. That helping? Uh, I probably am still gonna want more furnaces, but at least that belt's gonna be a little bit more full. We can add more furnaces after if that's what we want. Let's go set up some poles and transformers. And we'll get that going. Why is this just not even... It is working. It is very slow. Okay. How is my resources over here doing? Does it tell me how much is left? Uh, you know, ferrite. No, all right, unreachable. Height, 131 meters, size oh, 14 by 10. Doesn't really say how much is left, but we're probably going to want to start looking for more at some point. Now, how many... Wait, where am I? Where am I? This is the right spot. How many of these do I have left that aren't being used for something? None of them. <laughs> None of them aren't being used for something. Okay, good, good. I love that. So we can probably try to get these plates out of here somehow. Oh boy, how am I gonna do that? I think we want to get them over there because... Plates and wires. We got wires there. We're gonna have plates there in a second. And this takes plates, wires, and rods, which is all three of those things. So if I can somehow get these over there we're gonna be set so i want to go up and i want to go up come on how do i do this am i going to be able to do this? oh oh we're gonna be able to do this all right so that is just gonna send all these plates up and over uh oh where am i uh oh i didn't want to do that Okay, let's just go back up here and do it the long way. Alrighty, so we're gonna send... Why won't you... Ugh! It's not... It's just not working. Come on! There we go. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go down. And then down. And we're gonna need some platforms. And I'm gonna need to get rid of this. All right, that looks good. I can set up all sorts of platforms over here. Perfect, let's get... Ooh, we don't have any more assemblers. Where are those? Hello? Assemblers, there they are. Take those. And... I need one square in between. Uh, maybe I should put this on the back. Alright, and then this is gonna have to come this way. That's not bad. And then I don't really need space in between these, I don't think. Alright, let's see here. Power pole check. And transformer check. So this is gonna take all three. And this one doesn't take rods, so we're gonna have to put the wires in. So we'll put the wires in. This one is gonna take both. And bingo. That should do it. So can I upgrade this entire belt? That's a lot of belts. Hang on, let's go see how many belts I've got stocked up. This has been running for a while, so we should have quite a few. 900, that's not bad. I'll take them, I'll take them. Let that continue to do its thing. And we can upgrade this belt. Upgrade this belt. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Now, this part is just going to end up being janky. And there's nothing we can do about it. Actually, we could. Hang on. I could do something extra janky because I love janky. We'll go up. And then we'll go down. 
and I'll go across. Then I can do the same thing we did at the other side. Where if we have enough and there's still some left over, they'll just go and they'll wrap around and get reused. Okie dokie. So that should be pretty good. I wonder if that means I can just get rid of this. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what that means. I'll just get rid of this. We'll go like that. We'll go like that. I'll upgrade that. I'll upgrade that. Okay. That is almost perfect. There we go. That is perfect. You'll love to see it. Okay. Good, good, good. Let's go see how this part is working out. We got some stuff. We have some transformers. You love it. And this is not getting plates. Ta-da! There we go. Okay, so let's go start making us uh, uh, power poles. And wow, this thing is just taking all of the bars. Very interesting. Oof, it's a lot of bars. Okay, it's fine. Once that builds up, it'll stop and we'll have more stuff, more room for other stuff. Um, let's get some more of these, some more of these guys real quick. Just a couple stacks more. There we go. And shall I start looking at some power? I think I probably should start looking at some power. What else do we want here? Assembler Mark II. Let's do it because we can. What is this? Pump? Increase pipe throughput with pumps. Okay. And what is this? A small power pole that can be attached to walls. Okay. That's going to be more appropriate when we actually have a factory. For now, I don't have a factory. So let's see. We want some steam turbines. We want some boilers. We want some pipes and some pipes. And that's like all of our plumbing stuff, I think, for now. It looks like all of our plumbing stuff. Can I combine these? Not yet. You should be able to combine these though. There we go. Take up a little bit less room. I don't know why I have these extra conveyor belt ramps. Just gonna put those in there. I don't need those in my inventory. Do I? Oh, I'm probably gonna have a whole pile of these red belts on me, too. There we go. Let's get those out of my inventory. Okay, so let's go see about this steam turbine mumbo jumbo. I'm probably going to need an input. So let's aim at the water. Learn more. Press F1. Pipe intake. Use the pipe intake to draw water and output into a connected pipe. The pipe's intake needs to be fully submerged. It does not need power. Perfect. I love that. Um, smelters. We've already kind of figured that out. Storages. Okay. So, well, all right. How do I rotate this? Rotate X axis. Ah, okay. We definitely want this to go up. Uh, so something like that. Learn about pipes. Yes, please. Pipes and liquids. Pipes are needed for the transportation of liquids and gases. They can only hold one unique type of liquid. There are multiple pipe shapes. Straight curve crossing. They can be toggled by holding down right mouse button. Okay. You can use the handheld tablet to check the content of a pipe to load or unload liquids uh, to a pipe connection point. There are three different types of connections, inputs, red arrow, outputs, green arrow, and bi-directional. Green cube. Bi-directional means that the content will both flow in Great and job out. On unlocking the blueprints for faster belts and assemblers. Okay. Together. We're paving the way for an ultra-efficient operation. Let's keep up the excellent work. Oh, you know it. Okay, plumbing tool. How to drain pipes. Sometimes mistake happens. Under oh, that's what this thing's for. Tip, in case the pipe's not working as intended, use the tablet. Okay. 
over distance throughput of pipes decreases as the rate of flow slows down. Counter this by adding pumps across long pipes. Pumps can also be used to create a one-way flow direction. Okay. Very interesting. So let's get this going. Is this something about a curve pipe? Ooh, a little elbow. Um, there we go. Is this above the water? <laughs> I don't even think it's above the water. Hang on. Straight. There we go. Now, you know what? Let's go up more. Can I drag these? Oh my god, yes. Yes, I can. Alright, so my generators are gonna be... Where are they gonna be? I actually don't know. Maybe... Up here somewhere? Um... Let's... Let's just start building drag mode horizontal. How do I... Vertical, there we go. Okay, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm gonna make a bit of a platform here. And I need to be able to get onto it. Okay. Let's see, how big are these things? I imagine they're gonna be pretty big. Oh my god. <laughs> that is big. Okay, um, hang on, hang on, hang on. We can fix this. We have the technology. I'm just... You know what? Let's go closer to the input pipe. Why not? Why am I going this way? I don't know. Alright. I am likely going to regret all of this. Alright, let's see. Where is that? Where is that building machine? Boiler and turbine. Boilers and turbines can be used to create power more efficiently, but it requires a more complex setup. First, you need a pipe intake at a water source to draw in water. As a second step, the water needs to be moved to the boiler, which will convert it to steam as soon as it is supplied with burnable items. Finally, the steam goes to the turbine, which generates high voltage power. Okay. I mean, this seems good. Okay, this seems good. I don't know. The only problem right now is... My fuel is very far away. Oh, I should have built it over here. Oh, I should have built it over here. It's not too, it's not too late. It's not too late. It's never too late. Let's just leave this. <laughs> I can clean that up later or we can use it. I don't know, but for now, I think I'm just gonna leave it. Let's go get some more platforms because we're gonna need them. And I'm gonna go and set up a better situation over there closer to where our fuel actually is. Let's go try it out. Alright, we did it. We got here. So let me see how this is gonna look. I'm gonna make a strip. And then once we have the strip, I'm gonna make a big old platform. Okay. And maybe I wanna go even farther out. I don't know what I'm doing. I have no clue what I'm doing. So there we go. Okay, that looks great. Now, what do I need? A... Is this the boiler part? Uh, input. Red. Input's red. So this is the steam... What is this? This is the steam turbine. Max steam intake, 360 liters per second. Now, how much does this make? 20 liters per second of water to make, oh, 360 liters per second of steam. Oh, so it's just a one-to-one -one ratio. Well, that, that seems good. Okay, so let's stick this right here. And I'll stick this right here um like that and then we just need to stick that in there steam input output input water how do i change that can i put it on this side instead i would love to be able to put it on this side instead 
input water. Well, would you look at that? Okay, we'll get rid of this. And I will... Um... Okay, we'll put this here. Connect this... Here. And then I just need to connect all of this. I don't know if it matters how deep this thing is. Okay. Is it... We're getting water. Missing fuel. Okay, well... L let's bring some fuel. Do I have any? Hmm... Nope. I do not... I gotta get all this technum ore out of my inventory. I gotta get all this stuff out. Jeez Louise. Okay. Let's just go grab some of that really quick and see if it burns. I'm assuming it's gonna be fine. Because it said... I mean, these are burning it, but let's just make sure... The burnable fuel. I think the UI picture also just had it going in, so we'll see how it goes. Manage inventory. Put that in there. Input. Making steam. Energy required. 3.6 megajoules per second. Is this thing working? No grid connection. I don't have power poles! I don't have power poles. Okay, well, I mean, the good news is this actually works perfectly. So... I just don't really like how it's set up right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Because it's going to be not very easy to expand. Can I play with this valve? No. <laughs> That'd be kind of fun. Anyway, it's not going to be that easy to expand. It's not going to look pretty just because of the way this is working. But we could probably get, like four of these in a line before it becomes an issue yeah that's not bad okay let's get some power poles i'm gonna run that um what am i running i'm gonna run this stuff i forget what it's called anyway i'm gonna run it over that way i'm gonna need a splitter in here somewhere though let's get a spot to stick it i'm gonna have so much junk in my inventory Okay, so we'll do something like that, and then I will get rid of both of those. Put that in there. And this is just going to run all the way over to our steam turbines. Alright, that should do it. Is it going to go in there? Intake. No power. Oh, I gotta run power over here. Oh, mm, that is not pretty, but it's not that bad. I just gotta go up like this. And this is gonna be hideous. Don't judge me. We're just gonna run right across. Oh my god, I almost guessed the right height. Okay, something like that. I'm gonna just bring this down a touch. And we're gonna bring this right over to our factory of power. Our power factory. Let's get this thing out of the way. And... Is that actually gonna line up? Okay. Look at that. Okay, so that should be working. I guess we should go double check. It's like an extension cord. Is that working? It should be working. Intake seems to be working. Okay, it's just not taking anymore because we're not actually using any of the power. I don't know what we need the HP power for, but I mean, we can at least get it set up and then we can try to figure that other stuff out after. But we're going to need the power poles and the transformers, which are way over here. And what else are we going to need? I think that's going to be it. That is going to be our HP power all ready to go. So let's grab, whoops, let's grab 
those and we'll grab these. I don't know what the transformers are actually for. Um, connection range, 10 meters. I don't know what that means, but we'll figure it out after. Let's get these power poles in here, those in there. Okay, I might just grab a few extra of those while we're here because we're probably going to need them. I don't know how long the power poles span. Should I just run poles all the way to like the middle of my factory? If I need power, I can get it from here. How do I connect these? Hello? Snap, rotate. How do I connect these? What the heck? Hello? High voltage energy. In foundry, there are two types of power, low and high voltage. Transformer, power pole. Power lines, high voltage power source. Power lines can be crafted. After you equip them, you can click on a connectable object to start a power line and click again on the desired endpoint. Huh? Hang on, do I have to get rid of this? How does this work? Not enough crates in inventory. Whoa, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Okay, you know what? Let's just go build it over there. And we'll run it this way and we'll see what's going on. Right, where do I connect this to power? Hello? Hello? Where is your power? Oh, is it just that? I think it's just that. So what if I was to say... Actually, what if I was to put a transformer here? No grid connect. Chin. How do we connect these? Aim closer point to place power pole small. I don't understand. Oh, hold up. I probably need actual wire. Is that a thing I can do? Electronic component. Wire coil? That can't be it. Is there electrical wire? Oh, power line. That's the problem. Let's just make a bunch of them for now and see how that works out. Okay, so that means I probably don't need this right now. Uh, I don't have room in my inventory for the power poles. I do not have room in my inven in inventory for the power wires. Oh, we can just destroy stuff. Destroy. 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 Yes. Oh, that is good. Okay, we'll destroy all this. Where do those wires go? Hello? I just made a bunch of wires. Oh, there they are. Okay, I'm going to put those in here. Now, if I was to connect this... Uh... This origin and destination are not allowed to be connected directly. Okay. If I was to connect this to this to this. <gasps> Bingo! Why is it strained? I don't know if I actually want this. Max transmission rate. Low voltage, high voltage. Zero batteries. What is this thing doing? Exactly. I don't understand the point of the transformer. Because it's just using power for no reason. Transformers have a maximum transmission rate. Sometimes multiple transformers might be necessary depending on the amount of power consuming machinery on the low voltage grid. Um. Oh, wait. Are we... Does this turn the power into low voltage? 
I can't tell if that's what it's doing or not. High voltage grid transformer. I think that is what it's doing. Oh. Okay. So now if we want to get more power, we need to expand this. Hang on, let's try. Real quick. Just just right quick. So, um, I do want to delete this for a moment because I'm not happy with the way that is looking. This is actually going to continue down this way. And that's going to allow us to get all sorts of new generators going. I can probably sneak a little bit more room out of this side. Okay, and I don't have enough generators right now to do more than one of these but I can set up one more and just trying to figure out where I should do this is it do I have it right next to it no I have one square in between so if I was to do this it's gonna look pretty good get a pipe get a generator get some inputs And then we just gotta get some water in there. No! <laughs> no! How dare you? Okay. We'll get some water. Uh oh. Get some water in here. Um, pipe eight. Hang on a moment. There we go. Put this on here. And put this on here uh missing fuel you say intake no building hang on this is going into a pipe which i guess is not no good okay so that is working that is working all of these are working so what i should be able to do Let's just get a little spot over here for a transformer. And a little spot over here for a transformer. I know it says these do 5 megawatts, but they can't do more than 5 megawatts. So... I'm going to put one on both sides because these guys here, they do 3.5. And I'm going to need a power pole for each of them. Like this. You need wire. Connect that to there. Connect that to there. Connect that to there and that to there. Transformer short circuited. Transformer short circuited is now disabled due to its underlying low voltage grid being connected to multiple different high voltage grids. Uh, all enabled transformers of the same LVG must be connected to the same HVG. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Can I connect? I might have to connect these together. Somehow. Connect this. Huh? Why won't that connect? Okay, let's see if I can get this. I broke everything, so we'll see. I can hook this up to here. End to there. End to there. Oh, do they only connect to three things? Ah, uh, darn it. Okay, hang on. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. So, then each of these is going to need its own. We'll connect from there to there, and from there to there, and from there to... Th why won't that one connect? There we go. We'll do that. That one's going to connect into there, into there, and into there. Restart all LVG transformers. Okay. So now they're all connected. I don't know how many wires I can connect to one of these things. But it seems like 
Okay, seems like we can do an extra one. I don't know what the magic number is for these. Does it say somewhere? Uh, can max connections five. Oh, that's a ton. Okay, but if I look at the grid now, we should be using all of this. My gas burners are off. Okay, that is exactly what we wanted. So that's like extra power now if we need it. And these guys are using what seems like quite a bit less fuel. So that is the dream. I actually love that. Okay, we can set up more if we need them. But for now, that is absolutely terrific. I love it, guys. I hope you are loving the series. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. And I will see you next time.